I've always been a fan of Misfits, and I just, I'm just glad to see it end on a high. That is actually very impressive. Oh my God, that is that's a man flying. The execs, the producers, uh, and Howard, the writer, creator, pulled out all the stops for episode eight. What's the plan? Do, do we have a plan? Running's the plan. There's no shame in running. I really went to town with these big VFX set pieces. There's a huge fight between our gang and the new vigilante gang. Okay, as I see it, we're getting into a fight with people with much better superpowers than us. Define better. Flying. So powers, electricity, <laughs> flying pianos. <laughs> Lots of things that hopefully the fans will really be liking. <laughs> flying. Electricity. And that is camouflage. You are superheroes, guys. You are. So the jumper posse, yes, uh, disparagingly, as the character Sam calls it. Mate, that has got to be the worst fucking name for a gang of superheroes I've ever heard. Well, just we'll work on it. I'd love it to be called the jumper posse because I think we sound like an awesome hip hop crew. <laughs> the jumper posse. The jumper posse. We could be like the new crisscross. What would we do if we were a gang of superheroes? We'd fight crime, wouldn't you? Like muggers and rapists and things like that. Sounds quite. Dangerous. We get introduced and, and, and Rudy's trying to get us into a gang. He wants us to be a vigilante group and go around saving people because we've all got ace powers and he hasn't got one. I think I'm your mentor. Like the talking rat on the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the, uh, uh, Splinter. My name's Ellie Kendrick and I play Helen uh, and my power is being able to shoot electricity out of my hands. It's pretty good. It's like essentially being the owner of a loaded gun with a hair trigger and any slight annoyance might lead to your demise. Yeah, I'm sure there's other things you could be doing. Pretty girl like yourself. The character becomes bigger and you kind of learn more about her. Did she shock your balls? Why would she shock my balls? I don't know. Maybe she's into kinky stuff. My name is Michael Winder. I play Sam. I can fly. Unfortunately, um, I can't actually fly. They didn't know that in the audition. <laughs> if I really needed a proper superpower, it would just be to arrive places on time. <laughs> but, I mean, flight would be a great way to get there. Got that! That's pretty good. That's just generally practically useful. Yeah. Karen has the capacity to camouflage, make herself not quite invisible, but camouflage herself against surfaces and then come out of that camouflage and reveal herself. My yeah. character is creepy, so I'm just yeah. getting... Yeah, are you creepy or misunderstood? Uh, let's say misunderstood, but she is quite creepy. I <laughs> She'll be here any minute if you run a bit late. I'm here. Kate has to sort of uncamouflage herself, so yeah, that's quite a tricky. You know, there's lots of like setups and, and loads of green screen work. Oh my god, have you been spying on us? No, I just. I got here early. It's your superhero, Leia. They're your costumes. Rudy is convinced that his destiny is as their mentor to bring them together and in some way to use these powers for good. This is our destiny. But the road to hell is paved with good intentions. You shouldn't break into other people's cars. <laughs> the jumper posse, who are the, the vigilantes, I mean, they don't even really like each other. <laughs> they have nothing in common at all other than destiny. They're coming. I suppose you better kill them. Unfortunately, they get too, uh, too overconfident with their powers and they start killing people. <laughs> we kind of turn evil. <laughs> and they have to come and sort us out. It's amazing what you can go people into. It's all going to be over. It's, it's terrifying. I loved this. I loved it, even before I had any relationship with it. The last episode is fantastic. I think there's something to be said for quitting while you're ahead. Friday is the last day when the gang are all together down in Thamesmead, and that's the last time they'll all be together. Uh, and I think there'll be a bit of, I think there'll be a bit of hugging. Yeah, how do you feel? Happy, excited, sad, and I kind of feel all of them. I am just about to do my last, my last shot of Misfits. She's just a little bit um, eerie and strange. Yeah, I think I'm going to be a little bit teary. I'm sad that it's coming to an end. And it's been such a good laugh as well. It's been the best job I've ever had. It's the right time to finish, you know. 
It is the right time to end the series. I agree with them totally, but it doesn't mean that it's going to be any easier. It's a waving bye to this incredible job.